So this Russian spy, who was also a double agent for MI6? Yes, that's correct. All right. So he worked for MI6, London's Great Britain spy agency, where Christopher Steele worked. Mm -hmm. So this double agent gets poisoned last, last week. Immediately, the news media in London and New York and Washington blames Vladimir Putin for poisoning him. Right. That Putin got another guy, poisoned another person in London, all right? right? And that's why I joked. I said, well, you were going to find out this guy's connected to the dossier. And all not, right? But just a couple days later. It comes out that right. they're connected. Okay, so maybe the Russians didn't poison him. Maybe somebody connected to the Clintons poisoned him. When you look at this, right now we're at a, uh, a junction, let's say, at the Trump investigation, whether it be the House Intelligence, the Senate Intelligence Committee, everyone now is really starting to uh, look through what evidence was used to potentially get those FISA warrants, what part this dossier played in, in actually launching those, the surveillance against President Trump. So you look at Christopher Steele and his associates, all of them, actually in the New Yorker, New Yorker did a, a very long piece about Christopher Steele, the man who supplied the, the dossier, Rick, and they mentioned that Christopher Steele was actually pretty worried when he started to hear that his name was being brought up in the House Intelligence Committee hearings. So if you're someone who knows him, if you're someone that maybe even helped in the procurement of intelligence for this salacious dossier, yeah, I think that your premise would be correct. You would be worried and maybe even there'd be a motivation to silence you, to get rid of you, the same way we saw victims and, and, and witnesses disappear in the Mita, Arkansas investigations. That's right. So now the people connected to the dossier that smeared President Trump, these people are starting to drop dead. Right. Imagine that, like Seth Rich. Yes. We got another corpse, and nobody will ever tell us the truth about it.